go. Como son del terrorismo que tanto golpean. Colombian capital, Bogota, the polls opened with a minute's silence for the three candidates killed during the presidential campaign. It was the culmination of weeks of terror. The mayor of Bogota, Andres Pastrana, was the first to cast his vote. Despite threats of increased violence, the polling stations were crowded. Voters have 12 candidates to choose from, but there are four frontrunners representing the ruling Liberal Party, the Conservatives, the now disbanded M19 guerrilla group, and a breakaway Conservative running under an independent banner. As the queues grew during the morning, security was much in evidence. Besides dogs trained to find explosives, armed guards supervised and searched voters as they entered polling stations. The man expected to win is the Liberal Party's César Gaviria. He arrived surrounded by bodyguards and a media posse. He's pledged to continue the present administration's hard line against the drug cartels. Countering their intimidation campaign, President Barco had called on the electorate to vote, saying that Colombia's democratic future depended on it. la poderosa voluntad democrática del pueblo colombiano